you can talk till you're blue in the face about equality for people with disabilities, but when you actually just see someone on stage in a wheelchair doing professional level contemporary dance, it just breaks down all the barriers. I think something like dance, especially where people are, it's very physical, people are touching, they're, they're doing routines together, they're, they're, they're moving and working with each other, that breaks down a huge amount of barriers and it gives, it gives people a chance to realise that uh, you know, disability is not something that defines the young people, it's just an aspect of their lives. You go beyond what you think you're capable of because you get caught up in the moment. And I think that's actually true also for the able-bodied young people who come in because there's a fear for them. I mean, some of them may never have related to people with disabilities before. They might be scared about touching people with disabilities. They might be scared of looking at people with disabilities. And all that gets broken down in this really non-verbal way very quickly. And it builds up such a quick level of trust that I think it just makes people be more physically expressive. I think it's not only an inspiration for our young people, but it also gives, um, gives young people without disabilities a better impression of, of what can be done by people with disabilities, you know. So it's very much a, a case of us being able to focus on the ability of the person rather than just seeing the wheelchair or the disability the whole time.